Honolulu police are searching for a suspect wanted for breaking into and stealing thousands of dollars from a Kapahulu restaurant. It's the latest in a string of recent criminal activity targeting local businesses. KITV 4's Chloe Markley spoke with the restaurant's owner, who's reiterating the importance of having security measures in place. This is the lockbox the thief broke into early Friday morning to steal from Alejandro's Mexican food on Kapahulu. A lot of people see opportunity, you know, and uh, they're going to try to get what they can. The suspect walked away with two cash registers, a safe filled with thousands of dollars and Internet equipment, all adding up to about $5,000. You can see the footage caught from the security cameras showing him in action. But the restaurant owner says installing more cameras can't hurt. There are a couple of blind spots that we had and, and now, you know, it's sad that we have to go through something like this in order to address those matters. But uh, we'll try our best so that we can try to prevent it from happening again. The founder of Stolen Stuff Hawaii says where you decide to place your cameras could make all the difference. One of the worst things that people do is that they have the cameras pointed over the top of their head as opposed to in their face. You need to have the cameras directly in their face because that's the only way you're going to be able to identify them. Because Alvarado's were high up, HPD has a tough time identifying the suspect's face. Alejandro's was also lacking a security alarm, something Kitchen says is necessary for businesses if they want to be safe. A loud ringing alarm because that draws attention to them. Surrounding businesses employees say safety needs to be a priority. You work here at night alone and I am a female. And they say they hope this never happens again, but improvements to safety will have to be made for that to happen. As a business owner, you put your hard earned money into it and now that money is gone. So I do hope they are caught and we bring safety back to this neighborhood. Alvarado encourages businesses to act now to avoid becoming a victim of theft. He says he hopes the Kapahulu neighborhood can go back to feeling like a safe place people can come to and enjoy what it has to offer, especially his restaurant's delicious food. We want to do whatever we can to uh, recreate this uh, safeness, security. Uh, also, uh, let others know, you know, that things like this are happening in the neighborhood to watch out for one another. Chloe Markley, KITV4 Island News.